The polymerase chain reaction, or PCR, is a technique that can produce over a million-fold amplification of target DNA within a few hours. PCR requires specific oligonucleotide primers and plenty of nucleotides for DNA polymerization. It also requires a heat-stable DNA polymerase because PCR requires repeated cycles of heating the solution to 95 degrees Celsius. The polymerase tack from the thermophile Thermus aquaticus is often used for this purpose. In PCR, the reaction mixture is heated to 95 degrees Celsius for 30 seconds to denature or separate the DNA strands. The temperature is then lowered to 55 degrees Celsius for 30 seconds, which allows the oligonucleotide primers to anneal to known DNA sequences flanking the target DNA. The oligonucleotide primers, which are usually 20 to 30 nucleotides in length, are made so that they're complementary to the flanking sequences. The temperature is then brought to 72 degrees Celsius, which is the optimal reaction temperature for TAC DNA polymerase. The polymerase uses the primers as starting points for DNA synthesis, adding one nucleotide at a time to create a complementary strand of DNA. The cycle is repeated, starting with the 95 degrees Celsius heating step. Cooling the solution to 55 degrees Celsius allows the primers to anneal. Heating the solution back to 72 degrees Celsius allows polymerization to proceed. After two cycles, four double-stranded target DNA sequences exist. After the third cycle, eight copies exist. After the fourth cycle, 16 copies exist. After 25 cycles, about 30 million copies of the target DNA exist. Because PCR reactions require 25 to 30 heating and cooling cycles, a machine called a thermocycler is used to reproducibly and rapidly deliver these cycles.